Watching the news unfold this week after a Whangarei high school student was killed while on a caving trip has brought back all sorts of feelings for Elam College principal Murray Burton. It does bring a lot of things back. Um, feelings of um, not anxiety, but it, it, you know, overwhelming, you know, enormous sort of life that's ahead for that school and for that family. In 2008, six of his own students and a teacher were swept away in a flash flooding accident in the Mangitopopo River. The students were taking part in a canyoning activity at the Hillary Outdoor Education Centre. This week, a Whangarei Boys High School student disappeared after he and 14 of his Year 11 classmates got into difficulty on a trip at Abbey Caves. His body was found late Tuesday evening after specialist equipment allowed rescuers to work into the night. Burton's wasted no time in reaching out. I simply wrote to them today through their website. I'm very happy to help in any way, shape or form. But just wanted them to know that uh, one of the key messages is um, you never get over it, but you work through it. Now, there will be accountability. Uh, you know, there'll be huge investigations and the school will have to go through that and they will have to be held accountable uh, and so on. But, you know, we're quick, we're very quick, aren't we, to, to form an opinion, make a judgment call, be super critical. That's probably not going to be really helpful for the family. A public outcry has since blasted the school for allowing the trip to go ahead, despite the region being under an orange heavy rain warning. Police refuse to speculate on what happened and have been instead ensuring the family is being offered support. WorkSafe, meanwhile, have started investigating the tragedy and the Education Ministry's traumatic incident team is supporting the school. There'll be a time for questions and those questions need to be answered and I'm sure the school won't shy away from participating um, as fully as possible. Uh, but right now, you know, we really do need to focus on uh, just helping and supporting people, those students uh, and the family. There'll be a lot of emotion, um, in particular anger as well as sadness, but there will be a time uh, for all the questions that people have to be addressed. You're at the mercy of, of the police investigation, the Labour Department, uh, the school's investigation, what what the legal fraternity are saying, uh, what documents they require. It's a very long process and you just at the mercy of that process. Fifteen years on, learning to live with loss has been a journey and for Whangarei Boys High, one that's only just begun. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. To stay up to date with all the latest news from the New Zealand Herald, click the subscribe button below or check out one of the videos here. And head over to nzherald.co.nz for more details on these stories and more.